In this video, we'll take a look at the McMaster Car Library and how to bring its components into Fusion. Click Insert, Insert McMaster Car Component, and you get this browser window. You can scroll down to see all the things that you can bring in. Maybe you want to bring in something from screws and bolts socket head screws, alloy steel socket head screws. Click on a part number, click on product detail, and scroll down till you see this drop down window. Click on it, and there are options for 2D and 3D drawings. I'll bring it in as a step file. Click Save, and there it is. It's fully editable. You can see its entries in the browser. Now let's go back and look at this some more. I can scroll down here and click any of these options or I can do a search. Maybe I want to find gears. Here are different kinds of gears I can choose or I can just click here. And now look at all these options. Pressure angle, number of teeth, pitch, material, and a lot more. And I can choose any of these or I can just scroll down. Maybe I want plastic gears. And again, choose the file that you want. I'm going to click on Step again, Save, and there it is. Now I'd like to show you how to navigate with that browser window because it's not real obvious, I think. So if you've clicked on a few screens and then you want to go back, you need to right click on the window and click back and back and back and that'll take you right to where you started from and you can also go forward. You might have noticed that under the insert menu you can also choose insert a manufacturer part from parts for CAD. And that takes you here. You can click on any of these companies icons Let's just click here, AirTac, and see all the things they have to offer. Maybe I want an accessory, and I'll just keep clicking until I finally get to this. To bring it into Fusion, I do need to give them my email and accept their license agreement. So that's how you bring in ready-made components into Fusion.